see this place right here, it's really beautiful. Oh, it's really black. channel everyone join me in this video as we explore the wilderness for some aquatic moss if you're new to this channel consider subscribing and click the notification bell for future videos all right here so we are looking at a star moss uh, probably the most common moss here on this video uh, normally found under the bridge or even places close to human population. Alright here we have Pelia moss, also known as coral moss. Now one thing I've noticed about this moss is that in the wild they like to grow on, uh, on places where there is no competition. So if you check uh, there may be just a little bit of moss surrounding where it is growing but um, pretty much in places where there's uh, no moss at all like uh, like this one uh, it just grow there on that rock and uh, no other moss closest to this oh, some best place to find some aquatic moss is that uh, on a big rock where there's a lot of moss and uh, you can normally see these type of moss on, on the edge of the rock so normally close to the water surface Now what you see here is some type of a, looks to me like a weeping moss. Now they may be growing on top of rocks. Now in order for you to determine if these are aquatic, you may, you can just take a look at farther around you and uh, you should be able to see some of this growing uh, underwater or pretty much close to the water surface. So yeah. Just take a look around and you should be able to see something like this. A very tiny frog with grasshopper. Weeping moss. But look, they're completely submerged underwater. So these are purely aquatic and different types of moss on this place now looks like here we have some type of uh, terrestrial moss sorry about that yeah then we have like a star moss over here and some type of i don't know i'm not sure what this is and then it looks like we have another looks like we have like a fissident type of moss here right. and we have some type of I don't know <laughs>
Here we have some type of a terrestrial moss or something. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Now the finger. Yep. Very good. See that? Absolutely beautiful. Wall. I'm not gonna mess up with that guy. It looks like a tarantula or a, I don't know. But here, guys, as you can see, these moths are actually the weeping moths that I believe in. Yes. And here we have some bunch of pelias. So pelias, uh, you can see there. Many pelias. They're also well. Maybe underwater? A little bit of underwater. Oh yeah. Now you see that these are aquatic moss. They've been submerged there for quite a while. But I'm really interested in this stuff here. Look at that. No, I'm not just kidding. So once again, they got a guardian. We're not going to mess up with this guy. You don't want to mess up. He looks really aggressive. Yeah, we have some dissidents. Out of here, I 
think it is. Yes. Amelia Moss. And look at that. And some patches of dissidents. No, they're actually different. They're always separate.